Hey guys, it's Raytana Seishin, and I am going to try Raytana Says one more time. But you see, what I'm doing today, do, 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 today, um, instead of clicking record set, oh no, blue screen of death, okay, just kidding, um, instead of recording the sound through the screen recorder, we are going to try making it so. Screen Recorder Gold does not record sound, and doing Audacity instead. So that way, I will have the video, and the audio, and it doesn't have to merge a goddamn thing, bitches! <laughs> okay, so, um, what I did today, um, I made a special video that you guys are not gonna see until the end of next year. Sorry! Um... So... Here's my little program. Um, I've used the trial uh, on di many different computers to do many different awesome things. Um, I used it. I believe I used the Pro 2 version. This is the Pro 4 vi version of Corel Video Studio. Um, and that's how I um, how I did Coda's last video ever, ever. Um, and uh, I was gonna, I use, gonna use the trial, um, for 30 days, and then buy it later, uh, with money that my dad was gonna send me for Christmas, but then I saw how much it was today. It was 50 bucks. I saved a hundred fucking dollars! <laughs> so I bought it now, and when I get the money, I'll just, uh, put it in my bank account. Yes. So, what I'm doing today... Well, let's see if I have more stuff. See, the problem is, is I can't find half the filters that Corel Video Studio 12 had. I'm thinking if I go... Well, let's see. I tried downloading um, 12 off of a torrent, not to... Uh, not to use the crack or the key gen because that is like super illegal but to see if I could access the trial download from it um oops that is still a recycling bin hello hide um okay well speaking of sirens there was a big ass crash yesterday right across um the street from my work holy shit it was um some dumbass and don't be this dumbass. Please don't be this dumbass. Um. Fuck. It's only the fucking keygen. I don't want that. <sighs> Delete again. Okay. Some dumbass ran a red light. And. Ran into this other car. Flipped the car over. And it was like smoking and crap. And we were. And the, uh, a customer came in. And they were like. You know, there's a crash outside. He saw the whole g goddamn thing. And he, he, you know, we, we went out there and it was insane. Um, and after a while, some ambulances came and some fire trucks and stuff. And I have no idea if the people are okay. I know somebody got pulled out on a stretcher, but I, I mean, I hope they're alive. It's serious, like, <laughs> Anyway, yeah, so don't be that idiot. Now that I have shared to you that little thingy, I will tell you what I'm doing today, and then I will just talk. Because that's what I can do, but talk. Woo! Okay. So, you know my song, Time. I believe it is probably one of the most successful songs that I have written, aside from um, Love in a Nutshell and Upbringing. Uh, let's see, where is it, 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 where is it? There you are. So I decided that I want to make a music video. And I didn't want to make a music video in, uh, Windows Movie Maker because Windows Movie Maker doesn't have half of the shit that this thing does. So I can actually make it look cool, yo. Make sure I'm only at four. Okay. So... Um, I'm probably not gonna work on it whilst doing Raytana Says because 
I have to concentrate <laughs> on lip syncing and crap. Um, so, let's see, what can I do while I'm speaking? Okay, um, well, I can tell you about this. Yesterday, no, I, ca I can't even keep track of time because of this. Okay, so, the day before yesterday, I woke up at, um, 10.30. I slept in. 10.30 in the a- 10.30 in the a.m., everybody. 10.30 in the fucking a.m. <laughs> so, these are all the pictures that I still need to edit, and some of these are really damn old. Like, these ones from the, my black hair. Um, even though it does look pretty good. I liked my black hair. But, that looks really good. Anyway, um, so, I woke up at 10.30, um, and then at about 1.30 in the morning, um, you know, like, later that quote-unquote night, even though 1.30 isn't night, it's the morning. So, 1.30 a.m., I lay down to go to sleep. A couple hours later, I'm still awake. Uh, <laughs> still awake. And, um, that's Whitney. And so, I decided, well, maybe I can get to sleep if I listen to something. So... I decided to put on my iPod and listen to the rest of I Fell in Love with a Murderer because I started it a couple weeks ago, started listening to it just when I was bored. But I need to listen to it all the way through. I really, I listened to it and I was like, holy shit. Um, I'll reflect on that in a minute. Um, I don't know why I closed that. So, I listened to it, I listened to the rest of it, and uh, still wasn't tired. Um, so, I got up and I checked the time, it was about 4... 30 in the morning. <laughs> so, <laughs> I uh, took my iPod and I took a drawing pad and I took my journal and I went into the other room and uh, about 5 o'clock, um, Mike woke up and was like, are you okay? And I'm like, I can't sleep. I suddenly I found myself ins with insomnia. And mind you, I haven't exactly had insomnia since I was 18 and 19 because I was super stressed. And I'm thinking that I couldn't sleep the other night because I was stressed. Because it's the week before Christmas, we close at fucking midnight, and I have to work fucking Christmas. So, uh, ooh, excuse me. <laughs> um, maybe I should move all these. So I literally, after that, I went onto my computer to work on some stuff. Um, I actually got quite a bit of stuff done. Um, I got some some pictures done. Ooh, gothic me! <laughs> and um, I stayed up until well the entire morning. I like this picture. This five me's is awesome. I'll explain that picture in a minute. <laughs> And it was finally about, let's see, I finished editing my um, Domination audiobook, so I listened to it while I was still editing these pictures. Not this one. Um, and <laughs> by the end of the book, and while I was rendering, um, I was rendering something, I started to fall asleep in my chair. <laughs> and finally, it was about 1.30, um, in the afternoon, and Mike was like, you need to sleep, and I was like, no, I have stuff to do, and he's like, you need to sleep, so I lay down while he was watching Smackdown, I believe his, I believe his was Smackdown, because he already watched Raw, I lay down, and I started listening to my audiobook of the closet, and I fell asleep for about three and a half to four hours, and caught up, um, I want to say I got up around 3.30 or 4, so I don't think that's I don't think that's three or four hours. The point is, as I got up around there, I started editing the video that I made today, um, and then I went to work at 6. My shift was 6 to 11.30, and man, was I dead. I was, I was, like, you know when you're tired and you, like, giggle and stuff like that, and you're like, wee, you know. I was that. I was delusional. And I came home, um passing the lovely garden of ambulances and fire trucks that were outside. <laughs> and I went straight to my computer, even though I was exhausted as shit, and finished the video. 
Um, and then at about 2.30, I was like, you know what? I'm going to bed. And I was afraid that I wouldn't be able to sleep without taking some sleeping pills. But I didn't want to take sleeping pills at 2.30 because then I wouldn't wake up until like 1 o'clock in the afternoon. So I, um, I just laid down. And luckily, I got to sleep after maybe an hour or so. But uh, come on, this is ridiculous. This is fucking ridiculous. Why can't I get to sleep? Damn you, Christmas! I love Christmas, don't get me wrong. No bah humbug for me. I just don't like working it. <laughs> Okay, so let me explain this picture real fast, and then I want to talk about I fell in love with a murderer. So, I had an idea to make this picture, um, by my many different personalities. Um, I actually explained a lot of this on my DeviantArt. Um, I'm gonna pause this, uh, and I'm gonna go and... No, no, I don't need to, I don't need to. Okay, so this is the, um, the cutesy Raytana that is kind of like airheaded and oblivious. This is the artistic Raytana um, that, you know, is artistic. This is like raver Raytana, um, you know, whose, you know, crazy bright outfits are just crazy and bright and in your face, motherfucker! You know, this is. Uh, uh, I think I dubbed her like normal Raytana, like everyday me, I think. And this is a uh, Raytana that has the hairdresser in her, the, um, the stylish one, the part of me, believe it or not, I am a little vain, not like super vain, like I'm the best in the world and I'm prettier than you, no, not that vain, more like, you know, well, I'll wear this and I'll look good doing it. It's, um... It's usually like, cause I'm I'm very self-conscious. So when I find myself looking good, I'm like, okay, I feel nice. Cause when I when I ha finally have confidence in myself, it it feels really good. And it's not like the type of confidence where it's in your face and I'm like, you know, telling you how horrible you are. It's it's more like um, s emotional medicine, where I'm like, okay. So I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna feel pretty today, and I'm gonna actually say that I look pretty, pretty. Okay, so we only have a couple minutes. Um, so I fell in love with a murder. If you haven't read it yet, or um, the first 15 minutes of the audiobook are on my YouTube. If you haven't read it yet, go fucking read it because it is probably one of my best stories ever. No, not probably. It is my best story ever. This is the costume for the Time Music video. Um, and the second best story I ever wrote was The Closet. Even though I wrote it when I was 17, I still believe that it is very successful. But I fell in love with a murder. I was listening to the audiobook. And I was listening to my voice. I never realized how my voice sounded. Like, when I'm talking, I don't really know how it sounds. Um, but goddamn. I was... Here's the cover. Love the cover. Okay, so the main character's name is Kodo. I try to make myself look as much like a guy as I could. And I love the knife, dude. It's beautiful. This is like my favorite cover. So, um... Crap. So it's my most successful story, and I was listening to my voice, and I was like, holy shit, does my voice really sound like that? Because it's like... It's... I mean, I don't want to sound vain again, but it's... Cool. It's like... When I'm, when I'm speaking as him... It's like, because he's supposed to be really smooth talking, even though he's a deranged murderer. And I'm like, dude, he sounds fucking sexy. And then when he goes insane, I'm like, holy shit, he sounds crazy. And it's like, and then um, doing the narrative part too, like, um, you know, he ran out across the street and yelled, blah, blah, blah. Um, it's really dramatic. And I was like, wow, I really like this. I need to listen to it from beginning to end nonstop because it is my absolute favorite stories and it still gives me chills and it still makes me go, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I know that's kind of weird to talk about your own story like that, but you know, we're already at fifth or 14 and a half minutes. I am going to go now. I'm going to go work on this music video. Um, I will see you um, soon. I might do another, Raytana says. 
and you will see this music video later. So, goodbye. Have a good day.